All right, guys, so we are already in FL Studio, and guys, when it comes to Don't Oliver beats, I always start with some lush chords, uh, some lush chords on the piano, on some synths, man. Honestly, guys, you cannot go wrong with that. So we're gonna do just that. So I'm just gonna play around a little bit on my MIDI keyboard, uh, and let us see what we can come up with. Yes, sir. You guys already know that was extremely fire, so let me just put it down real quick and uh, I'll be right with you. Alright guys, so we already got this super, super fire uh, chord progression, man. Uh, let's just listen to it. Yeah. Okay. Okay, I pull up. up. Oh. All right, guys. Now that we have that, we are gonna uh, copy and paste it to uh, this preset. A lot of Don't Oliver tracks, man, uh, contain this this kind of synth that is playing chords, uh, like on a breakdown and so on. But uh, we're just gonna use it uh, in the beat. Guys, right now it's time for this juicy synth bass. So guys, once again, we're gonna mess around uh, with my MIDI keyboard and see what we can come up with. We're gonna have to clean this up a little bit, but uh, we got a very nice bass, so uh, let's just get on with it, man. Let's just add some RC20 uh, on the synth uh, to just make it more, more vintage, you know what I'm saying? Some combo crusher for, for the distortion, you know what I'm saying? 